well today we're gonna show you how to dress up for the fall because it's that time of the year when it starts getting quite a bit colder nights are really cold days can be a little warm but still chilly so it's always important to know how to dress up to enjoy the outdoors The single most important piece of equipment you should be wearing when you're hiking in the fall? Something orange. It's hunting season, so make sure you wear lots of bright colors to be visible and make some noise as well when you're walking so that you don't surprise anyone, any hunter. So layers are your friend any time of year, but even more so in the fall because you know, you're, you're going, you might be hiking along, you're sweating like I am right now, and then you get to the top and the wind picks up like this and you just get really cold. So make sure to have you know, a windbreaker, um, maybe a down jacket or at least a nice warm sweater, and you know, some nice hiking layers too. Almost there. So if you're from Newfoundland, you may have heard the term or the phrase, bless your cotton socks. Well, when you're hiking or in the backcountry, cotton is not something you want to be wearing. Today I wore cotton socks, actually. That's why I'm thinking about that. Um, but yeah, stay away from cotton. Once it gets wet, it just pulls heat from you and causes you nothing but problems. So sometimes you don't really want to get outside because it's cloudy, gloomy, but there's something about hiking in clouds. Like look at this, it's just so close. I can feel like I could touch the fluffiness. Can't. So fall or autumn is a season that gets really wet, really muddy. So when you're hiking in trails, when it's really wet, you want to try to stay dry and keep your pants a little clean. So gaiters will be your best friend. It's just a waterproof piece of fabric. So it prevents the water from getting inside your boots. And it also protects your pants from getting wet, dirty, are ripped apart by thorns. All over. So you get to the top and the wind picks up, you gotta start throwing on those layers. So I got the nice bright toque so people can see me, don't think I'm a moose. And a bit of down. This might be a bit overkill, but it's windy. We'll start with that. If I get more cold, I got a, uh, a uh, windbreaker as well, rain jacket. I de-layered, the down was a bit too much. So just breaking some wind now. If you enjoy those kind of tips, make sure to subscribe down below so that you don't miss any of our other tips. Have a good one!